Welcome to the Game Taffy Panel Panel the the Taffy Panel Show or Panel Taffy Panel Taffy. There we go. That's the one. All right. Well, I'm Kyle, and with me is Clint. And we don't need last names because we just don't. If you want to know, you can look it up. And today we're going to be talking about achievements. A very good discussion. Well, we certainly hope so. <laughs> now, Clint here is of the opinion that achievements enhance games and make them a better experience. I beg to differ. Just, just tell me now, what is your argument? All right, well, I feel like achievements... I, I, I understand that they're kind of a meta game within a game, and people love to collect them. That's some crazy drive that everybody seems to have. That's why Pokemon is so successful. Um, but for me, when I sit down to play a game, I want to play a game. I don't want these stupid little milestone trackers. Oh, you've walked 10,000 feet. I want to know when I've walked 10,000 steps. That is very important to me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so my point of view on this is, is yes, you know, you don't want trophies to take away from a game, but th at the same time, I don't think they do. I mean, you don't, if you're not interested in trophies, then you don't have to pay any attention to them. Um, me, when I play a game, what I like to do is, is beat a game, and then if I don't have anything else to do, I'll go and try to get all the trophies. For me, it adds a really big level of replay value to the game. I'm not 100% against achievements here, uh, and they, they definitely do add replay value, you which be. is <laughs> which is absolutely a worthy investment. But my, my real problem is when I play video games, I, I, I play them to go into a different world. I play them uh, so that I can kind of lose myself in something else, and nothing breaks that uh, that that world and that involvement like bing achievement unlocked that doesn't make any sense to me and i can see where you're coming from um, i know personally that i can let trophies become sort of an addiction and you know i, I have uh, i think 963 trophies is what i <laughs> went and found um, four of those are platinums which are extremely hard to get um, I got those on Uncharted 3, Uncharted 2, Skyrim, and Infamous. And, you know, during that time, all I was doing was playing, trying to get trophy after trophy. So I can see how it can become an, an addicting thing and take away from the gameplay in mm -hmm. that sense. Do you, have, do you play Nintendo or do you have a Nintendo Wii? I do not. Okay. Because for me, I have one, but I never play it because there's no achievement system. Um, I really liked uh, Wii Sports Resort because it had a stamp system. And for me, it gives a lot of value to that game. Um, but at, to the system as a whole, oftentimes I, I can't stand to play my Wii because I don't get as much as, of a sense of accomplishment as I do when I'm playing my PlayStation or even um, digital, uh, digital releases. Mm -hmm. um, like Steam, they have um, a tre a ch achievement system as well. Yep. And I, I guess part of my antagonism towards achievements comes from my background as mostly a PC gamer. Uh, just, like you said, Steam does have achievements, but it's by no means a big deal. There aren't, well, I mean, there are, you can have pop-ups say, that say what you have achievement, but you can also turn those pop-ups off. You can totally eliminate Steam from any in-game experiences. And it might not be a big deal to you, but I know for me, you know, I kind of get a sense of uh, uh, competition as well with achievements. And I, I love to, to go on Steam and see what my friends have and see what achievements I can try to get to kind of one-up them. Um, I, I'm really not that competitive when it comes to co-op or online gaming and things like that. But when it comes to achievements, I, I do uh, get pretty competitive. <laughs> to wrap this up, if you like achievements, wonderful. That's, that, it works for you. Uh, but honestly, I really don't think they contribute all that much um, to video games. And if you think that achievements are a worthwhile piece of gaming, let us know. Bye. Right. Later. <laughs> I'll pay 80. I paid $80 for Halo Reach. There you go. All right. You're welcome. <laughs>